Hello everyone and welcome back to Cronus Place Weekend in 5. Today we gotta go to the Sun Palace to advance the story. Fun times. Now, before we actually do that, um, we are level 17. That's not exactly where I think we should probably be for what I want to try to do. Uh, but there's, other than grinding, there's no other way to do it. Uh, for Siles though, Let's see, I think I want to change, we lose a lot of magic there. Do you lose a skill point if I do this? You do, okay. So we can't do that just yet. Unless I gain a bunch of magic. Uh, not magic, levels. Uh, that's unfortunate, but also kinda necessary. Uh, there, let's just say there's gonna be something optional that I would like to do. I went the wrong way. Of course I went the wrong way. Well, I mean, technically we could make it. Ah, we can make it actually over there. Um, I wanna check out the rare finds before we go in the Sun Palace. Just in case there's really good armor we can get. But yeah, so. Hmm. Yeah, it's not really worth it. Uh, there's really not much here we can do either. Bracers. Actually, long range is actually five. That's not bad. Does help up with Silees a little bit with her long range. You know what? Go for it. There you go. It's four points of defense as well for the other ones, but eh, that's not that important. All right, now we can go to the Sun Palace. Yeah, so th there is something optional. We're probably not going to be able to do it. It is not easy on a non-New Game Plus to do. Um, but we'll give it an attempt. If we succeed, go us. If we fail, I will blame my upbringing. Because that's how that always works. <laughs> All right. So, yeah. For some reason, I thought I ended right outside the Sun Palace, but we didn't. You can go around talking to people you want. I uh, don't really need to, like at all. Ah, oh, well, well, Frey, sadly, you're back. Ah, welcome home. What, only Farid and Kyle? That's hardly a welcome. <laughs> Ouch, that hurts. <laughs> Sorry about that. I thought it'd be better if we kept the little matter of your visit to Rafflee quiet. Uh, Miyaki's filled me in what happened. Thank you for taking care of that. George Leon, uh, sorry for all the extra trouble. Uh, that's hardly what I call trouble. By the way, have you, you noticed that we sound the same, Farid? Uh, we get to meet a lot of people, a lot of new people, and it was fun, too. Cronus got lost on, lost on the ship <laughs> a few times, but he's fine. Uh, I hear that I'd like to hear that I'd like to hear what you have to say too, but you must be tired Why don't you go ahead and get some rest now? Oh before you go you better say uh, uh, hello to your mother. I think she's in her chamber now Right, okay, well, I guess I'll go take a bath and freshen up then <laughs> I'll join you Kyle Sorry, just kidding You'd better be Have I mentioned how glad I am that I didn't let you go to Lunas? Oh, so, uh, only several times today, your majesty. I'll go make yourself comfortable in the guard room for now. Oh, George, by the way, uh, could you come visit me later? There's some, this is, sometime this evening would be nice. Got it. George has left a party. Silence has left a party. Let's go see Mother. Oh, hello, Kyle. How's it going, buddy? How was it? Oh, come on, you know what I'm talking about. Purification ritual, you must have taken a peek, right? Am I right? I'm right, right? They're my little sister and aunt. I know we're a royal family, and I know that shit is pretty, or at least was, fairly common back in the day. But no. So who do you think was the hottest? Well, no you ask, really. It had to be Siley's. You're kidding me, you didn't look? Why the hell not? That was a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. Pretty sure that wasn't a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. Your mother's in the back room. Don't keep her waiting. I'm not going to. And I'm not saying that as we have a chance to do it now. I'm pretty sure 
it's just not a once in a lifetime opportunity like god sakes man it should never be an opportunity in general like for for that not at all at all bye leon uh how come all right yeah how come her majesty hardly ever invites you to her chambers i bet she has something that she wants to talk to you about in private okay you would also just kind of leave if that was the case Home. Hello, mother. Isn't Leon with you? Yeah, she was awkward about this. I see. She wanted to give us some time alone, did she? I guess consider it. Come on. Come a little closer. So you made friends with not only Hazwar, but Hazwar, too, did you? I was close. What did you think? They're nice people, aren't they? Yeah. Getting the support of those two will prove to be very helpful to you someday, I'm sure. And that day might not be very far away, I'm afraid. Gazelle is coming the day after tomorrow. I want you to know we're not just waiting around without any plan. We're taking every measure we can. We're certainly not going to let Godwin have everything his way. I wanted to tell you at least that much. Now go back to your room and get some rest, okay? Okie dokie. You've grown so much. Okay, you could have hugged me before I walked away. Pretty soon, you'll be taller than I am. A great big man like your father, Farid. Ah, uh, unlikely. He is like a foot taller than me. Children, both you and Lynn. I want you both to know how truly proud I am to have you. Oh, that wasn't ominous at all, Mother. Oh, Prince, you done with your talk? Oh, your faces are red. Well, I guess it's none of my business. Yeah, it's not. Just a mother having a perfectly normal, non-worrying conversation. Alright, so now... Actually, can we go in these these rooms over here? No, visible walls. I was gonna say, I don't think we ever had a chance to go into those rooms. Why don't I just go back to our room, I think? Alright, anything else? Faja? We need to do things prepared for an engagement room. But, we can discuss that later. After you go see Lim, you should get some rest. Alright, go see our sister. So we have a sister. I guess we could go to the guard room as well, right? See how George is doing. See how the other knights are doing. Hello? Oh, hello, your highness. How have you been? I haven't seen you since uh, Stormfist. What am I doing here? Farid summoned me. He wanted to uh, speak to me about something. Though I do not know what he wants to discuss. I just got here myself. Ah. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, no, that's right. <laughs> Just remember some gross yet. Don't worry about it. Hello. The princess must be quite excited about her engagement. Gazelle will bring even more power and glory to Felena. Uh-huh. I'm glad you made it back safely, your highness. It is true that the people from Lafrit desecrated the Holy Land. If so, they must be punished to the maximum extent of the law. A public execution would seem appropriate. Felena Raffles must also be held accountable. You're very good at... Diplomacy. You look tired. Uh, things are gonna get pretty busy soon. Just make sure you get plenty of rest. Galleon around here? I know Miyakis is with, uh... Oh, there you are. Dude, you blend in. Welcome home, your highness. It's good to have you back. Bye-bye. Yeah. He blends in really, really well. <laughs> Alright, let's go see our sister. Oh, we can go see Silas too, but I think she's sleeping. So now would be a good time to torment the lady in waiting. Because we're really, really not cool. Oh, wait a minute. Silas, are you not here? Oh, wait, are you above? Okay, right, you're on the second floor. My bad. You're near uh, Lim's room, right? Let's not accidentally go into her room then. Pretty sure she wants to hear about Raffleet anyways. So this is Siley's room. 
Oh, Prince Fei! Uh, Lady Sadly's in the bathroom. Oh, oh god, okay, never mind. I didn't want to go in there. I'm never gonna beat those allegations for that keep up. Hi, Lim. Welcome back, Prince. Okay, didn't mean to talk to her. Fei, you're back! How was Rathley? I wish I could have gone with you. Oh, okay, never mind. I thought you actually had a cutscene. Time to go back to uh, my bedroom then. And sleep the night away. Oh, so away. Oh, we already checked the rune room. I think that was something we had to do earlier, but either way, we did it. So yeah, so definitely, before you do this, make sure you're, you're pretty much done with what you want to do, right? Welcome back, your highness. Are you ready for bed? Like, if you want to keep trading and waiting for it to restock, go for it. Uh, if you want to gain some levels, go for it. Want to max out your uh, your weapons to level five? Go for it. Uh, you're not gonna be able to do that for a little while. So now would have, well, then would have been the time when I told you to finish what you needed to do before coming into the Sun Palace. Man, is that is that why you invited me to Felena to ask me to do that? Can't say that wasn't part of the reason. It's, if that time ever comes, I'll do it myself if I have to, no matter how hard it would be. But if, for whatever reason, I can't, someone else will have to do it. We must be prepared for anything. So, you want me as your backup plan, is that it? Yes. Only, you're the only one that I can trust completely. I hate this. I do too. ominous feelings at all <laughs> perfectly normal conversations all around how long have you been standing there for man or did you like have someone come and tell you that they were in view of Sophilena? yeah oh, I gotta go stand on the the bow, right? Or no, I don't know what the hell it is. The head. I'm going to strap you there like a mermaid. Perfectly normal engagement. Guys, guys, with the, uh, what's with those faces? Oh, is it Kyle? Oh no, it's Sileys. Lady Sileys. It's supposed to be a happy occasion, but you two look all so gloomy. Uh, what the hell with this farce? Uh, I guess we do. Well, as long as you're aware of it. Not quite beaten. Uh, now, quit being a wallflower. I'll hang out with you, so come on. Hey Kyle, how's it going? <laughs> Gazelle doesn't even have one female attendant. What's up with that? Does he even like girls? Guess in his, his engagement isn't really the place for him to be bringing girls, but still. Yeah, Kyle, no, you're right. It's not really uh, appropriate for, you know, you to bring girls to your engagement, I guess, if you have ulterior motives. It may have been best to hold the wedding today as well. Oh, for the engagement? Nah, man, we can wait till she's, like, an adult. A time has not yet come, your royal highness. It's too early to feel tense. Please, preserve your patience. 
Uh, hello. Dot dot. Huh? Oh, what is it? Pardon me, I was lost in thought. Anything else? Perhaps I'm a bit nervous. Oh well, yeah, maybe, I guess. How about you? You have anything? Strengthening ties will help God and will help solder for Okay. Um. Yeah, we'll go over that a little bit later. Hello, Mikis. Hey, Prince! During the ceremony, you gotta shout, No! You will pry my dear sister from my cold, dead hands! Come on, I dare ya! <laughs> I'd yell out something if I was sure they wouldn't kick me out of the Queen's Knights. Hello. Ray, this is supposed to be a happy day, but I just feel sad. And even I can tell everyone else has a fake smile on. Only Gazelle seems happy. <laughs> yeah. Hello, Mother Dog. By the long face, Frey. You're here to celebrate your sister's engagement. Try to look happier. Even if it's only for a few hours. What? Oh, okay, never mind. I thought you had something new to say. No. How's it going, Frey? You've had enough? Uh, not yet. I want to finish talking to everyone. Alright. Well, go around and talk to everyone. Yeah, okay. Hello. Ah, greeting your highness. It's been far too long. First, allow me to apologize for my absence, uh, uh, the absence of my father. He would have liked to attend it, but I request that he stay home. Frankly, I would find it a little embarrassing here if I would be accompanied by my father at this age. I mean, fair enough, I guess. Alright. Cool beans. Splendid fanciful occasion. Oh! Ho, ho, ho. Okay. Nah, no one really has anything else to say, and I think that's pretty much it, right? Uh, actually, hey. Well, this banquet is a boy. I mean, sorry, it's not my place to say. <laughs> Finally. Anyone else? Alright, how about you? Feel a bit out of place? Yeah, relatable. All right, now we can go talk to Faja and then, uh, well, get the show on the road. Venus, please don't bump into the mic when I'm recording. We have standards of quality here, Venus. As she says, oh, I'm sorry. Yeah? I'm not sure if the mic's picking it up, but she's meowing at me. Gazelle, evening, sir. Is the banquet over already, sir? Yes. It's the princess's bedtime, you see. A little while ago, an attendant came by and brought us some of the banquet food. It was quite delicious. Ah, oh, probably. Thank you. <laughs> hey, what's wrong? I wonder. Kidding. Yeah, I know. It's pretty obvious, right, Venus? <laughs> Gazelle, sir. Please wait aboard the ship, sir. We'll come see you when it's over. Uh, someone might look familiar to those Very that played well. uh, the other Suikoden games. I want you to take them to the sealed room right away. Yes, I know. That man in red. Something about his manner disturbs me. I want him watched. I'll put someone on him. You can rest assured. Can he? Fine. Do that. Gazelle, sir. What about Lady Silides? Worried about the lady, are we? How sentimental of you. You have your orders, just do as instructed. Yes, sir. Alright, well, clearly shit is hitting the fan now, huh? I do like their uh, uh, weapons. Hello. Aha! Uh -huh. Caught you. So as you can see, we were probably kind of prepared for this, right? We knew you guys would put Dark Arcanum in the banquet food. And that's why we all took an antidote beforehand. Well, some We've of the guys outside. Now. Don't even try to make they got excuses. screwed. Godwin didn't see this coming, I bet. Mm. What did you say? The reason we used that drug was so we wouldn't have to sacrifice so many of you. Now there's only going to be more unnecessary bloodshed. Give up! You have no chance! 
No, no, she's right. You don't have a chance. But anyways, boss time. This dude has about 680-ish uh, HP. Silies, why the fuck are you up there? To be fair, I guess we only have so many. Uh, uh, you know what? Use the fire arrows, yeah. So many slots. It's not like you putting in the middle would be any different. I well, might. Oof. Ow. Oh, he's dead this turn anyways. Here we go. I think fire arrows do what? It's like 60 damage? He does have a decent amount of, uh, what's it called? Uh, magic fence too anyways. <sighs> what was that? He's as tough as a demon. I wonder if he's a member of... Who are you? Answer me! Damn, poison. Looks like he took the easy way out. We might have underestimated our enemy. If there are many more this tough, we'll be in trouble. Um, uh, worried about Mother and Lynn. Yes, me too. Let's get- I'm not worried about Mom, to be quite honest. She has the sun rune, but still. Leon? Coming! Alright, let's see. Now, uh, let's heal up just a tad. There we go. To be fair, only getting 6 HP. Uh, let's see. Do I want to swap positions? Yeah, I mean, that's fine. It's fine for right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, no, 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 wait. We want this one. Yeah, that's fine. It really doesn't matter. They're, we're probably gonna lose completely anyways, <laughs> just so we're clear. Um, but it's gonna be worth a shot, right? Almost, okay. Yeah, almost certainly. They're still battling. We haven't fought them off yet, or could they be beating us? We're not gonna help anyone stand here. Let's go. All right. Hey, battle. Gonna need this heal again after this. I just auto battle for Leon. He's dead. Come on, attack twice. I mean, I guess we could... Technically level up a little bit here. Yeah... Um... I would like to get to level 19, and we're right next to level 19. If I could get to level 20... Further, those might be set battles, though. I don't remember if they're set or not. Um, I do want to. Oh, no, they're not. Okay, good. So I think we'll get to level 19 then, and then I'll heal up. Stop attacking her, please. I might be able to put on, um, Incantation, then. She learns, uh... It's another level. So yeah, I'll be right back when Silees levels the 19. Okay, so I put Incantation on Silees to hopefully get out shredding pretty fast. Uh, much faster than I could without it. She does lose a bit of magic power, but... She still has her level 3 spell, so... Uh, this way is blocked. We have to find another way. But yeah, we should be relatively fine, hopefully. Hopefully. What's that? Asha didn't use the sun rune. Alright, well that's not a good sign. Look. 
too late. He only has one wound. A fatal one. We're not dealing with any amateurs here. Clearly not. <laughs> I'd say that fellow was a little too weak, that's all. Probably true, too. We should have a level requirement for guards. Well, well. Hello there. I'm glad to see you've saved us the trouble of coming to get you. But why are you... I get it now. You never were a gladiator in the first place, were you? <laughs> Very perceptive of you. At the Sacred Game Finals, you had to go and interrupt me just when we were getting to the very best part. I've been hoping I do that. to get the chance to thank you for that, you know. <laughs> Back off! Now I see. You're the reason our Dark Arcanum didn't work, aren't you? Huh? Who are you? Don't you remember me? I guess I really shouldn't be surprised. We were just little kids back then. But I remember you, Misma. Uh, Mikafut! No, that's impossible! You think I better, like, easier names so for me to pronounce? Remember me then. <laughs> this just keeps getting better and better. Imagine that, a Queen's Knight's Apprentice, His Royal Highness's bodyguard, one of our old friends! Leon, what are these guys talking about? Prince! Lady Sialit! Hurry! Huh? Run! <laughs> Not so fast. Alright, so this battle's completely optional. Um, we don't have to win it. If we do win it, we get money, experience, and a piece of a prosperity rune. Um, that being said, it's not easy being cheesy, but on a non-New Game Plus run, this is extremely hard to win. You want to be probably like level 20, to be quite honest. And you need Sylees to be able to bust out a uh, shredding here and there. If you have the water rune, that might come in handy, but you actually do need, like... Uh, the Prince and Leon using the Swarm Protector to hopefully kill these guys before they fucking kill you. Uh, being said... Whew, yeah, being said, uh, it's still really, really hard to do. Um, there are rare finds that you can get to make things easier if you're willing to grind up the money through trading or just battles. Um, your skills can't be above level C at this point outside of New Game Plus. They both have about a thousand HP. I think it's like 98, uh, 980 and 960. Uh, Childric, I think, has a slightly higher one. Ildric, whatever the hell his name is. But, yeah. Well, well, we'll give it an attempt. We might even give it like two attempts to see if I can get it to actual work to, to, to be them. But I'm not making any promises here. Uh, because to actually do this outside of like purposely grinding for it and looking for rare finds to make yourself strong even at that point it's really hard to do but it's not really expected to win this fight so yeah let's go ahead so first things first uh swarm protector i, d I don't think it matters Kildrick i think has slightly more damage here we go Okay, so 270. It's still actually really fucking slow. Alright. Probably shouldn't have kept the magic stat on then. I was hoping she would actually outpace them. But that's fine. Uh, is it fine though, Kronos? Not a hundred percent. Fine. Oh, there we go. She can heal herself. That's good. Okay, so one more. Should kill him, I think. Heal yourself, Silas. We'll heal Leon next time, and hopefully, we'll kill Kildrick we this turn. No, he's weakened. Shit. Okay. Yeah, if I was level 20 or higher, he'd probably be dead. Okay, that's unfortunate. That's really fucking unfortunate. Uh, 
there. Sure. He's dead. Mm, yeah, okay. Shit. Okay, this is gonna take a lot longer then. Yeah, should be fine. That's unfortunate, but we're good. I mean, I guess use the scrolls. I bought them for a fucking reason. They're better than your normal attack. Not by much, though. But she's gonna have to heal now. There's one more healing rune thing. So, we... We should win. I'm actually gonna have her take out. Oh, we can't take it. Just do that one then, yeah. I guess I gotta have the prince heal her. No, no, she's good. Alright, so take out a mega medicine to use on yourself. And you'll fully heal next time. So, yeah, we're good to actually. Oh, no, that was. Fuck, that is not what I wanted, but that's fine. No, wait, no, that's the wrong person. Sorry. <laughs> I guess a normal medicine would have been fine for her as well, but still. Never mind. You should be fine. I'm going to heal next turn anyways. Prince is going to gain a lot of experience. <laughs> That's fine, though. The way it works in Suikoden, that even if he gains a lot of levels here, it's not going to really offset the balance too much. He'll probably only get into the mid-20s, if I had to guess. All right, hey, we won the optional battle. Oh, he didn't even gain a level. Oh, fuck him. Uh, but yeah, we got $4,000, we get a Prosperity Rune piece, and 40 Party SP. We didn't gain a level there? That's stupid. <sighs> that wasn't half bad. To be really honest, I thought you'd completely bore me. No, they aren't hurt at all. But I'm afraid playtime is over. Ugh. <sighs> Hello. Yeah. Yeah. Kyle, so guy. Yeah, use the water rune outside of combat. Woo! I don't know why I like that so much. <laughs> You saved us! Uh, sorry, it took so long. Never mind that, what's the situation? It's not good. The enemy is unnaturally strong. Much more powerful than our guards. Our defenses have been shattered. I might not have even gotten here myself if I hadn't gotten help from Zagai. Where could Lord Godwin have found these soldiers? They're, they're Nethergate members. I'm positive of it. What? But Ashtat disbanded them! I think, no, I know Lord Godwin sickly took them in. No, that can't be true. Nethergate killed Gazelle's mother, Mashkel's wife. They've, they've been mortal enemies ever since. And you're saying the Godwins have had Nethergate on their side for eight years? Yes, I am. Leon, how can you be sure? I'm sorry, I promise I'll tell you all about it other time. Some other time. After we get out of here, Prince, we have to go. Uh, I can't leave Mom and Lim? Your first priority is getting away. Another red wants your blood too. Another gate wants your blood too. Prince, you have to understand. You have to protect your bloodline. That means fleeing at a time like this, even if you want to stay and fight. 
You have to let us do our job and protect your family at any cost. I'll find Her Majesty and Prince the Princess, and you and Lady Sileys better run now. Is that all right with you, Lady Sileys? Yes, just take care of Ashtad and Lim. I won't let you down. Yon, know, I'm leaving the Prince and Lady Sileys' safety in your hands. All right, uh, I'll better see you again, Kyle. It's a guy, you go with the Prince, all right? I'd rather stay. There's more fighting here. I know, but please, I'd be I feel much better if I know you were with them. Fine. Thanks. I'll leave first. Give me a bit of a head start and then make your escape. Good luck. You'll need it. The guy has joined the party. Alright, did we get fully healed from this? No. Alright, so the guy is actually level 23, which is pretty good. I'm gonna go ahead and put this up here, and then reposition. Like this. And that's good. Uh, so, hey, let's look at the guy's stuff, right? So, the guy's got combat teacher. He also has attack. He's actually really good at attacking. Um, he comes with the, the uh, wrath rune, which, uh, is that a skill rune? Recovers 50% of lost HP, causes fury. Right. Okay, so it's, uh, you use it, you restore yourself, become berserk, pretty much. Though, not berserk, but fury stat, right? Um... He is mainly a physical fighter. He does come with a, a secondary rune slot, though, so if you want to attach, like, a gale rune on him or a, a killer rune on him would go a long way. Um, but kind of like George, he is stuck with one slot. So you do kind of you kind of have to work around that. He's still pretty good. Hold on a minute. Oh, I need a heal. I didn't heal. Let's head towards the Queen Knight's room. Uh, Queen's like guard room. I know an escape route. I didn't heal. George. You guys, what are you all still doing here? What about you? Aren't you supposed to be with Arstad and Farad? George. The Queen and Farad, they're dead. Wh what? But Farad... No! How can that be? George, you were with them! How? I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but there's no time to grieve now. The Sun Palace is about to fall. You've got to get out. Wait. Just a minute. If Arstadt is dead, then that means the Sun Rune must have gone back to the Sealed Room. That means, if Godwin gets a hold of it... Kyle went to the Sealed Room for us. All you have to do is concentrate on getting the hell out of here. Uh, what about Lim? What about Lim? Don't worry, she's alright. Miyaki's and Galleon are with her. Leave Lim to them. Um... It doesn't really matter which one you choose here. Uh, it's... You, you, you can't go back either way. Um... It's, it's like, it's pretty much do what they said earlier, leave, preserve the bloodline. Because you gotta remember, like, I might not be part of the royal, like, uh, like a set, uh, an heir to the throne, the secession line, because I'm a guy. But, at the same time, it is my bloodline, right? And, like, if I have a daughter, she would be in line for the throne, saying if Siles wasn't there, or if Siles didn't have a daughter as well. Um... So it's one of those, when it comes to royalty, the bloodline really is something that they all are concerned about. And throughout history, even in today's standard, that shit is pretty held sacred here and there. Um, but 
Let's see. Uh, no, you know what? I want to go save my sister. No, Prince, we have to leave right now. I don't like putting it like this, but in a way, Lim is already safe. Look, the Godwins intend to install Lim as a figurehead queen and then somehow control her. The fact that they waited until after the official engagement before they made their move proves that. So there's no way they're going to harm Lim now. But you and Silas will just get in their way. They'd love to kill you both. That's right! The princess already lost her mother and father today. You can't let her lose you two, uh, two, you two too. For her sake, you have to run. Um. All right, Prince. Okay, let's go. You two, the guy. I was already planning on it. There's an escape route ahead. Let's hurry. Join has join has joined. Uh, George has joined. I also think George gained a few levels. Yeah, he gained a few levels since he left the party. Uh, he's been killing a lot of people, so you know he gained some experience. Um, that being said, I guess put the prince in the back a little bit. Actually, you are slightly stronger. There we go. Though, I don't think we're going to be getting into really any combats going forward. Oh, that's right. Your weapon's level one. I was like, your attack stat should be higher than that. But yeah, we're good. Uh, yeah, we should probably heal. Not discard. There we go. Just in case we get into a random battle. I mean, there'll be random battles outside, but... Is this the way? Yes, hold on a second. You know, now that I think about it, why don't George and Leon and potentially some other Queen Knights know about this escape hatch? That's kind of interesting, actually. You would think they would know about that, even if it was just meant for royalty and not the guards. They, Yeah, right? Actually, wait. Hold up. <laughs> That's interesting. Huh. I don't think they ever explain that, though. Oh, well. A boat, huh? This was all set up a long time ago for emergency escapes. We're probably the first to actually ever use it. Okay, we're shoving off. Get in. Prince! Please, don't look back, your highness. Uh, if you keep trying to go, I'm pretty sure, like, the guy or George knocks your ass out, and then you just wake up here. That would be the sun rune returning to the sailed room. That light! The sun rune. It's returning to the sealed room. It's true, then. Princess, please hurry. I'm trying. Carrier, my mother and father. Galleon, weren't you with them? Princess. doing here princess stay back <gasps> what's going on hello princess and where might you be going what oh no <sighs> Damn. what tell me what's going on here you're the ruler of sun palace now princess we can't just let you leave now can we So if you didn't notice during the festival, Zahak and uh, Alania, whatever the hell her name is, uh, 
acted very differently compared to like the guards and the other gu Queen's Knights. Like they didn't know we were preparing an antidote for the anti for the sleeping drug because they weren't told. If you couldn't tell by some of their interactions between the start of the game and now, they weren't exactly the most trustworthy people and they definitely made their beliefs well known when it came to the godwins uh farad's not an idiot so he clearly knew that though then again uh one might even argue the fact that we didn't just blaze Stormfist palace or fortress with the sun rune might say otherwise when it comes to how we plan this uh it's all because of dawn i told you something like this would happen how could the queen's knight do such a horrible thing the rotten traitor the poor princess. What will she do now? We get new outfits. I have returned from my reconnaissance, your highness. Good work. So what did it say? Well, it said that Sofalena is virtually under the control of Lord Godwin now. But thankfully, the princess is apparently safe. So the princess wasn't able to escape, huh? But she's alive. That's what matters. We'll find a way to rescue her later, somehow. There is one more thing. It pains me to even say this, but a certain despicable lie has already was also written. Queen's Knight George Prime murdered Her Majesty the Queen and His Majesty Farid, then took the princess, uh, the prince hostage and fled. Oh no, that's horrible! Trying to put the blame on George, how dirty can they be? We intend to send a search party out this very morning. Your Highness, this isn't a safe place anymore. Might I suggest you go to Lunas and seek Lady uh, Hashwa's uh, help? Yes, that's a good idea. I'm sorry, but we don't have the strength to avenge Her Majesty and His Majesty. We can't even fight to protect our prince or Lady Siles. Please forgive our uselessness. Don't say that. Just hiding us until this morning has been a huge help. Oh, what gracious words. Prince, Lady Siles, an atrocity like this must be punished. Please, please survive, and someday, please return justice to our fair Felena. We beg you. Also, these these outfits are actually fucking pretty great. Like, there's no way for us to like look at them right now, but I love these outfits. I wish uh, this was like the main outfit. But anyways, we need to go to Luna's, uh, which is up here. Uh, as you know, we were just there. What about uh, Rafley Grunus? I'm pretty sure that one's already moved from here. So, but yeah, now we can see some more of the, the outfits here. But I don't even know where we got them. I think uh, I think we could say that George, you know, the Prince and Silies and Leon all have the drip. I think the youngsters are calling it these days. Look at them! They look amazing. I look. I wish I looked that good when I change clothes like that. I mean, I do look pretty amazing, but still, I don't look that good. I also don't have abs. You can count my keg. Not really, it's just one big ab. Anyways, so yeah, the main crux of the story has now begun. Shit has hit the fan, <laughs> as they say. And that is it for this episode. Thank you for watching, and I will see you all next time. Have a great day. Bye.